This segment of Hack 5 is brought to you by GoToAssist. It's time once again to check port 110. This week, Jeff writes in, I just got started using Ubuntu and I love Snub's Terminal 101 series. Thank you. On a hack tip, and that's over at hack5.org if you want to check it out. I am wondering, what are your favorite Linux commands? Ooh, ooh, ooh. I love these. What is yours? Okay. My favorite Linux command, bar none. And uh, this is just because, you know, when you've been doing the IT stuff and you've been like, preventing the fires and putting out the fires and making some fires along the way. Yes. Sometimes you just need to kick back. And I just discovered this when I was looking for a, uh, a version, a vanilla version of one of my favorite games. And it turns out there is a vanilla version. Vanilla AKA version? one that's not all OpenGL with mouse ah. support and everything. Okay. Um, uh, or mouse look. It's, uh, and so aptly, it's called Chocolate Doom. So sudo <laughs> apt get install chocolate doom. And then chocolate doom. Chocolate doom. Put attack Y in there so you don't chocolate have to hit yes there. Doom. And it automatically downloads, check this out, doom dash shareware dash wad or doom dash wad dash shareware. That right there, whoop, right above there, uh -huh. is uh, it's in the Ubuntu main repository. That's what I love. The Seriously? shareware wad That's file awesome. of doom is part of, oh, oh. Yes! And it works! Yeah! That's awesome. Ultra violence, man! That's awesome. I mean, how can you not have Doom on everything that you own? <laughs> That's so great. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, I'm a little busy here. All right, well... Oh, Paul, you should have seen that Why don't you cut down the gib. volume on there so I can talk about my favorite command? I can't. <laughs> and he can't. <laughs> well, my favorite command... I have to at least command... finish the level. Oh, I died. My favorite command is, you, you know about man, right? For man pages? Yes, sorry about that. It's, I know like everybody knows this joke, but it's still one of my favorites, man, woman. Okay, let me get that going for you. Man, woman. Man, woman. It says no manual entry for woman. <laughs> no, there is not, I let me tell you. It. It's so true. So it just happens to be one of my favorites. Okay. With all that said, um, let's take a quick break. When we get back, it's the Technolus Photo of the Week. Stay tuned. Working in IT means constantly jumping from one issue to the next. And let me tell you, those have to be solved fast. Every minute counts. So don't waste your time juggling different tools and duplicating data entry. Use GoToAssist from Citrix. They're the leader in remote support, and with it, you'll have the tools you need in their platform to work faster and more efficiently. See, GoToAssist includes three essential support tools that you can customize for your needs. GoToAssist Service Desk, which allows you to log incidents and track the res resolutions. GoToAssist Monitoring, which proactively identifies issues so you can fix them before they become a major headache. And Remote Support, so you can provide live or unattended support to any PC, Mac, or mobile device from anywhere to resolve the issues quickly. I know I've been using GoToAssist since I was a systems administrator in DC and let me tell you it has saved my bacon more than once. So sign up for your special 30-day free trial today. Visit GoToAssist.com, click the try it free button and use promo code HACK5. That's GoToAssist.com with promo code HAK5. It's time for this week's Technolist Photo of the Week. George writes in, I love the episodes on proxies, but our cat loves the show just as much. She watches it with me each week. And attached are some pictures of her cat, of his cat, Mitsuki, in her favorite napping and lounging spot. Hello, she is so cute. Mitsuki. She looks like my cat at home, my cat Luna. I love Pretty kittens. in black. Yeah. She's so adorable. Anyway, if you guys have photos, you can send them over to feedback at hack5.org with the subject line technolist. Did you know that cats have their own version of the internet where they look at pictures of people? <gasps> really? No. But it's funny. So, so anyway, I knew that's what it's they time were doing for trivia. When I was at home. Let's, let's trivia. Trivia. That, uh, last week's trivia question was: Who was the first woman to win the Turing Award, essentially for her uh, Nobel Prize in computing? And the answer is Frances Allen. This week's question is: Can a Z68 motherboard run two GPUs in SLI mode in NVIDIA or Crossfire X mode for AMD if two X16 physical slots are built into the board. If that wasn't a mouthful and you know the answer, you can answer over at hack5.org trivia for your chance to win some swag from our 
bag of awesome goodies. And keep in mind that we value your feedback, so keep that coming. Feedback at hack5.org. Let us know what's in your heart, and uh, specifically if you watch 1213 and you still have some stuff to share. I'm compiling a lot of that, and I appreciate all of that. So feedback at hack5.org. And check out all of the cool stuff that we do over at hack5.org slash follow. You'll find links to all of our social networks and what not to do over there. And I would also like to mention that we have a new show at youtube.com slash techfeed, T-E-C-H-F-E-E-D, and it is called Threatwire. It'll Threat be on Wire. every Friday. Yeah. Rawr! I'm excited so about this definitely check that one yeah, out. Yeah, this is really cool because we're taking the, this opportunity to speak about the things that we're really passionate about that yeah. don't kind of work its way into the show as far as privacy is concerned about, you know, the latest Social one I'm talking about. Social networking privacy. Security, uh, legislation, basically yeah. protecting the internet too, because this is our internet, and I feel sovereignty to this more than I do any other nation. So uh, it's really something that I'm crazy passionate about. Yes. Uh, and basically, the approach is anywhere between tinfoil hat and let's not throw the baby out with the bath water. <laughs> but. Um, and what about the hack shop? We have so much new stuff in there. Oh yeah, yeah. well it's the holiday season. We've got some great new stuff in the hack shop, including some fancy new pineapples. So check those out, as well as um, you know rubber duckies and Uber tooths and um, and the new beanies or toques if you're in Canada. So check oh, that out, hakshop.com. Eh? That's how you can support <laughs> us directly if you love what we do, and we are very thankful that you're tuning in. So just tell all your friends and keep tuning in, and thank you so much. Thank you, and with all that. I'm Shannon Morse. I'm Darren Kitchen. And we're reminding you to trust your technolest. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, I'm almost out. <laughs>